What's up guys, in this tutorial, I will show you how to fix network lag, a high latency, and packet loss while playing Lost Ark on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial. For more information, click on the first link in the description below. First, I suggest verifying the Lost Ark server status page to make sure that your network issues are not related to the server you are playing on. On this page, you can preview the server status for the four server locations and if the server is operational, busy, full or in maintenance. If you feel like the issue is related to your own network connection, then make sure to test your connection by visiting speedtest.net. A normal up and download speed without interruption is important to have a stable gaming experience. Especially your ping should remain below 100 milliseconds. When this is done, make sure to account for any VPN service which could be running on your system, or turn off your VPN while in-game. Make sure to use an Ethernet cable to ensure the best possible connection. If you have to use a Wi-Fi connection, then make sure to restart your router or modem if you haven't done this in a while, and reduce the amount of devices connected to the same network. Next, open up your task manager by searching for it in your Start menu search. In the Performance tab, click on Open Resource Monitor. In the Network tab, open the processes with network activity. And after a few seconds, you will see every process using your network connection. This might be your browser running in the background, Steam, or a download bottlenecking your connection. I suggest you only end the processes which you know won't break your operating system. Next, open up your command prompt by searching for CMD and hitting enter. Use the command pinggoogle.com. This command will check your latency and packet loss to Google servers. If your ping is higher than 100 milliseconds or if you encounter any packet loss, then you should make a few changes to your connection and follow the next tweaks. ipconfig slash flush DNS. This will flush and reset the content of your DNS resolver cache. Using this command can in some cases fix network related issues with lost arc. In case you still have latency and lag issues, then you should verify your connection to your ISP and make sure that you're using a decent data plan. You can troubleshoot this step by switching your connection to your personal hotspot for example. When this is done, we will change your DNS server address in case the problem is still caused by your network connection. Open up your control panel by searching for it in your start menu search. Make sure to view by category and click on network and internet. Next, click on network and sharing center and here select your connection. This will open up this window, containing some general information about your connection. Navigate to Properties and lastly, double-click the Internet Protocol version 4. Select to use the following DNS server addresses option and as your preferred DNS server, use 8888 and as your alternate DNS server, use 8844. This will, for a lot of users, fix network related issues when playing Lost Ark, as these are the official, public DNS server addresses from Google, which are safe to use. To further troubleshoot network related problems, I suggest updating your network adapter's driver. To do so, search for Device Manager in your Start menu search to open it up. Here, expand your network adapters. Right click the one you are using and select Update Driver. Finally, click on Search automatically for drivers. This will take a second to download and install the latest network adapter driver. You should also make sure that your Windows version is up to date. Search for Update to open up your Search for Updates system settings window. Your settings will open up. Click on Check for updates 
download or install now. And make sure to restart your PC after making all of these changes to your OS. Lastly, in case you still get network related issues, then you most likely have software running on your system which is hindering you from playing the game. To fix this, I suggest ending processes from running in your task manager of recently installed programs which can change your files or use up your available resources such as OBS, Shadowplay, CCleaner or Adobe applications to troubleshoot which program is causing the issue. In case you have any further issues or problems following this tutorial, then I suggest following my extensive guide linked in the description below. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.